We here at Hickson don't sell things, we sell memories. This egg show, many people have been coming for over 50 years. And so now they're bringing their children and the grandchildren to see them. We have eggs that are done in local people. We have them from Russia, we have them from China, we have them from Hungary, we have them from Ukraine as well as from Romania, many different types. I'm just covering real eggshells with vintage fabrics, and some of them are covered with rickrack as well, and I cut the fabric to fit the egg and then add the rickrack, and you can see the finished product here. And then the other eggs I'm making are vintage fabric covered also, but they're made with scraps, so they're, I'm calling them my patchwork eggs. And then also I'm doing the miniature scenes in the eggs, and this is my haunted scene this year. And then we have one here that is a haunted egg, which is an, it's a quail egg inside of a chicken egg. So that's a double egg, that's kind of fun. These are Fabergé styled eggs. I start with a raw egg. It is marked, possibly painted, and then it is cut open. Then it is lined with a velvet or nice fabric and the braid is put on and then it is hinged. Then we start on the outside of it. I'll usually work about six eggs at a time. Each one step has to dry a little bit. So while one is drying, I can go on to another one. You walk into a store and you're looking at a gift card, all of a sudden you look at a gift card and you figure, oh, this would be great on a winter egg or a summer egg. Um, I love fairies, my granddaughters love fairies. And this was, this started out just a green egg. But now we have a little cottage and a little girl going for a walk. So the idea, you never know where it's going to come. You might be just driving through a city or something and something just catches your eye. I had canaries at one time, turned them into little jewelry boxes and they actually work. <laughs> I haven't found the diamond to put in there, but still looking. I've been doing this as near as I can figure out 50 years. And I love every minute of it. Not every minute, but close. There's nothing in this store that you absolutely need. A lot of things that you'll enjoy. If you haven't been here before, you're really going to be surprised.